Police in Argentina have been describing the scene in the hotel room where the former One Direction star Liam Payne was staying before he fell to his death from a third-floor balcony yesterday afternoon. Hotel staff say they found total disorder, including various broken items and packets of medication. Police were called to the hotel after reports of an aggressive man who may have been under the effects of drugs and alcohol. Devastated fans have been gathering outside the hotel to mourn his death by lighting candles and singing songs. Our correspondent, Ione Wells, is there for us now. Ione. That's right, and this case is so shocking because it speaks to one of the real paradoxes of fame. Pop stars are people who seem to have it all. They are people that many envy, many look up to, and yet that spotlight means that they have to battle their demons very publicly. Now, from X Factor boot camps to live tours to talking openly about some of his struggles, Liam Payne's career was defined at many moments by moments of survival until now. Today has uh, certainly shone a spotlight on some of those struggles, leaving many questioning how could this possibly have happened. This is the hotel where Liam Payne died after falling off a third floor balcony. Emergency services were called by hotel staff on Wednesday evening. This 911 call, obtained by local newspaper La Nación, shows hotel workers were worried about his safety. What is happening at the location, sir? Well, we've got a guest who has had too many drugs and alcohol, and well, when he's conscious, he's trashing the entire room, and we need you to send someone, please. You said it's a hotel. What is called? Casa Sur Palermo. Casa Sur Palermo. And we need you to send someone urgently because, well, I don't know whether his life may be in danger, the guest's life. He's in a room with a balcony, and well, we're a little afraid that he... He fell after officers arrived and was rushed to hospital. But his injuries were too severe, and he couldn't be resuscitated. A lovely day here in Argentina. He was in the city on holiday, spending time with his girlfriend, Kate Cassidy. Attending a concert of his former bandmate, Niall Horan. I know that in the morning now. This is how many of his fans remember him and One Direction. Full of smiles and feel good tunes. The story of my life, I'll take you home. A far cry from the image painted of his final moments. But it was no secret that he faced troubles. He'd spoken openly about mental health difficulties, struggles at times with fame, parenting a young son, and alcohol. The problem we had in the band, and I don't blame anybody for this, I don't want to seem like I'm whining or moaning, oh my God, look at my life, whatever. But it feels to me like when we were in the band, the best way to secure us because of how big it got was just lock us in our rooms. And of course, what's in the room? Mini bar. Mm. So at a certain point, I thought, well, I'm going to have a party for one. And that just seemed to carry on throughout many years of my life. The BBC had also seen a cease and desist letter against the singer earlier this week from his former fiance, the model Maya Henry. She'd accused him of repeated unwanted contact, but he'd not responded to the allegations. In a statement, his family said he would forever live in their hearts and they would remember him for his kind, funny and brave soul. At the scene of his death, fans came to pay their respects. Just 16 when he rose to fame, just 31 when he died. Many of his fans feel they grew up with him. With his death, some feel a little part of their adolescence is gone too. Well, Liam Payne's body has now been taken to a morgue where investigations are ongoing. An initial post-mortem suggests he died from both internal and external bleeding. And an inspection has been carried out of the site where he died, where whiskey, a lighter, a mobile phone was found. A search of his room was already uh, also carried out where police found uh, total destruction. They found things broken and multiple packets of medication as well. Investigations are going to be ongoing as more evidence is collected. But for now, fans continue to gather here, lay their tributes, lay flowers, many around me in tears as they stand in shock at the news from yesterday evening. Ione, thank you.